This is a topic I know a lot about. Just a little. 69% <laughs> of us are missing one or more teeth. Yes. And for me, it was genetic. I was missing a tooth, I was right? say, how many did you have well, lost? Well, one. <laughs> one right there yeah. in the front. And my entire life just never came in. I mean, it was one of those things. Gretchen is back on the show. Hey, Hi, everybody. Utah Works tomorrow. Yeah. You have my dentist, Dr. I Jim know, my dentist, too, from yeah. Apex Dental. And, uh, you know, you and I were talking about dental implants. And, of course, mm -hmm. the first thing I thought about you was you because you've had your work done from Apex and Dr. Quant, um, but you, you, like Nisha said, 69% of people, adults, are yeah. missing at least it's, it's crazy. One it's a crazy statistic to think of. You know, when people are missing teeth, they always think, is it just from neglect? But a lot of times it's from trauma. A lot of times it's, you know, people that are just missing them right from the day they were born. And, you know, there's so many different avenues to go down, right. and implants are a fantastic way to replace those teeth. So. And, you know, if you remember that show, um, uh, not home makeover, but the makeover, extreme makeover. Yes. Yeah. The first thing they always would do was somebody smile. So I oh, can't yeah. imagine. You're, b between your eyes and your teeth, it's like the number one thing that people notice, you know? So, I mean, if you're looking to improve that, I mean, it's hands down, you got to do something about your teeth. Oh, yeah. Uh, so why aren't we doing it? And is it scary? I mean, I could tell everyone my experience. I probably just thought I put it off. Yeah. I had a bridge. I didn't like my smile, but I thought, I guess, I guess it's okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. How easy is it now to get oh, an implant? It's, it's extremely easy. I mean, you can go in the day there and get it done, you know, so it's, it's really nice. And with implants, I mean, before people would just think that it's there to just replace like one teeth, you know, or one tooth. Right. Now, like with dentures and things like that, you can actually attach dentures into implants and all, all the variety oh, of different wow. things, really? which is which is great because yeah. I mean a lot of the complaints that people have about dentures is they're flopping around they're slipping, and they fall out, yeah. they slip around, they mm -hmm. can't talk. Well, what I find interesting here is you you're talking about doing it with laser and it's a one-time only procedure. Yeah. yeah. So Explain so, that so the way the laser is is the laser it's a soft tissue laser that we have and, and we have them at all our apex offices and all of our doctors uh, that, that we have actually place implants, which is great. Um, but the laser assisted less than five percent of dentists are actually using that technology. And what oh. it is, it's provides faster healing time. It allows you to place the implants on the same day if you have the tooth extracted. It basically, anytime there's any sort of infection, any sort of bleeding, any sort of thing that you just want to uh, eliminate that's, that's kind of bad in your mouth, the laser can be used for. And, and it's a fantastic thing. The nicest thing about it is the, the pain level goes down with it and the really? healing time. And right now, one of the specials we're offering at uh, Apex is you can come in, you know, place an implant. You, laser assisted implant with it at no char additional charge with it. Wow. Sorry, is laser for all age groups? It is, yeah. And so I've actually used that laser on a one year old. Right. Uh, yeah, wow. so yeah, I use the laser. Uh, with what's it. the most common location to get an implant? And is it easier to put it some places than others? Sure, yeah. It's honestly, you have to have with an implant, you just have to have enough bone. You have to have enough bone both width and height wise, essentially. So uh, biggest area probably is the back that we put, place the implants on people. And, you know, the front, you definitely have to, there's a huge cosmetic issue that you oh, have to yes. uh, be yeah. very careful with. Yeah. And so, you know, there's bone issues that are, that are attached with it and stuff. So, I mean, something like your case, it was very, very thin bone. The and margin of error is so We were so just small. talking about, Nisha yeah. feels that she has the most perfect smile now. Do, People comment beautiful. all yeah. the time I brag about, about it, it. But yeah. I didn't feel like that for so no, long. No, you didn't. Yeah. And yeah. I think having the, a great smile or great set of teeth, it just gives you so much more confidence. Sure, ab absolutely. I mean, it's like I said, people notice right away, they'll notice your eyes and they'll notice your teeth and uh it's, it's amazing what it can do, yeah. you know, for, for your confidence. Well, and I'm thinking, too, with the beginning of the year with insurance benefits starting all over, why not start off your yeah. new year with a smile that you've always wanted, just like you, Nisha? No, I've been sitting up straighter. That's Aww. right. <laughs> Here we are. With your, with, with your choppers. With Utah your choppers. Works, you have to watch tomorrow at 4 o'clock right here on ABC4. And if you want more information about Apex Dental, give them a call. Ask them questions at goodforutah.com slash midday. We'll link you to all of their information. Sure. Thanks, you too. Thank you. you. Yeah. Keep smiling. I've been brushing. I, I love it. I love it. Song get the floss there. in there. Keep smiling. Keep shining. Oh, that's it. That's no, what it is. Yeah. We'll stop. <laughs>